Greetings my friends, and welcome to Skyrim Becoming High King. This is a new mini-series on this channel that I'm doing in the absence of Life of a Peasant to keep you guys sated Skyrim-wise on this channel. And uh, it is only going to be a short series though, because I do want to return to Copacus' story as soon as possible. But I thought, you know, this would be a fun little series to do, kind of in the absence of Life of a Peasant, and I've had this idea going for a little while. The title's kind of self-explanatory, but in this series, we will be becoming the High King of Skyrim. Now, will we be a fair and just king, or will we be a cruel and horrid tyrant? I do not know yet, my friends. We cannot see into the future of what this series will turn us into, but we might become a tyrant. It allows for us to become a tyrant, which would be quite fun to kind of behead people and send them to our minds and stuff, but I'm in this kind of kingdom right now. This is a throne we'll eventually be sitting on, and I'm not yet king, so uh, I'm only here admiring it. And I just want to tell you guys a few things before we start. This is my Dragonborn character, my high level character that I made years ago. I've chosen this character because this is really the only character I can do this series on. The only other characters I have are, are Copacus, and other characters like Copacus who are not very high level, only good for hunting, not very good for, for damage or anything like that, and haven't done any of the storyline or any of the quests on. So if I wanted to start again with a new character for the series, so I'd have to do all the storyline and all that stuff, and we don't want to do that because, well, we just want to get into the, the High King stuff, and it'll take way too long to get to it. It'll be like episode 70 before we start doing High King stuff, so... Yeah, I mean, we're just going to jump right into this. We have an already kind of decked out character, as you can see here. Got some nice armor. And uh, I think we're going to just jump right into this, guys. We have to head to Markarth. Oh, my god. These guards... Well, not my guards yet, but they're yawning. Let's just get out of here. What okay, so uh, this mod's already glitched. Freaking great. Bloody hell. <laughs> so, uh, as you saw from that, this is the entrance to the... Uh, High reach keep. So as you saw from that, not all mods are made equally, my friends. <laughs> some people take more care into their mods. As you can see, they're just a common glitch you get with some of these larger mods out there. So anyway, as I was saying, guys, we need to head to the Markarth Warrens to meet a uh, suspicious man who has an offer for us. An offer we may not be able to uh, refuse. So let's just head to Markarth right now. We will be fast traveling in this series because this is not as heavily RP focused as Life of Peasants. So... We don't need to travel on carts and camp over the lands and stuff. We want to head there as fast as we humanly can. So let's just go. So uh, yeah, we're not yet actually High King. We have to gather some supporters who will support our cause for coming High King. And we need to also gather a substantial amount of gold, which I already have because I've, been, I've had this character for a while now and he's already quite rich. So we just need to get the supporters. And ha, oh, there he is right there. This guy here. Sergus of the Black. Let's talk to him. You seem out of place. Who are you? Well, of course I'm out of place. I was just added by that mod. Oh, I see. Okay, some fourth wall breaking there. Okay, mod, mod developer. I represent a shadowy organization that serves to steer the course of history through unconventional means. You mean like the Dark Brotherhood? No, the Brotherhood is nothing compared to the organization I serve. They are merely a shadow of their former strength, no longer fit to operate. Okay, so this guy's uh, he's big. He's bigging up his clan. You humor me. We do, we do much more than just assassinations. Our reach is much further. So he's sounding quite dangerous here. I offer you Skyrim itself. Interesting, don't you think? Wow, that is a grand offer that I cannot refuse. All right, I shall take you up on your offer. Good, I've updated your quest channel. So as you can see from this, guys, there is no voice acting in this quest. Oh, hang on. One more thing. Our reach is far and wide. For a price, I can have any person you wish killed. Speak to me when you are ready. Okay, so that's pretty cool. We can get assassinations on anyone we want. Nice. Yes. Um, the Warrens isn't. Ah, oh, there we are. Mark, mark for death is how want? we is how we assassinate them. So anyway, as I was saying, yes, there is no voice acting in this mod. It's kind of, well, I guess voice acting is a hard thing to do for mods. So I'll I'll just be reading the dialogue for you guys, and uh, that should be good enough, hopefully. And uh, now we're just gonna jump right into it, guys. We're doing our first quest, which is to wear the jagged crown. This is the quest that's gonna lead us to become the High King. So we can either gain 40 supporters instead of 20 to become the voice of Skyrim's people. That means we don't have to pay any gold to become a high king. Or we can either marry either Ulfric or Elsif to gain the right to the throne. That's an interesting one. I heard that's glitched though, so it doesn't really work. So let's just scratch that one. Uh, we can either kill Ulfric and Elsif to forge our way onto the throne. That would be by the assassination thing. But I kind of want to imprison those guys later at a later date, so I won't kill them. So I think I'm going to go for the final option. Gain 20 supporters and 50,000 gold. Now, if that doesn't work, if there's not enough supporters who support me, I will just kill them and ascend to the throne via that way. Um, but hopefully, we should be able to gain some dang supporters. So we're going to head to 
um, the various yalls that exist in duh, 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 let's just head to the blue palace so yeah um, the yalls they will be supporting us because I fought for the storm cloaks in this account and so the yalls favor me so the current yalls in power will support my claim to the throne and so we can just get those supporters going and their Steel sidekicks. Oh. We support my campaign. No, that's true. Talk. See, he doesn't want to support my campaign. Why won't you support my campaign? God damn it. Don't worry. There'll be plenty of people to support us. But anyway, as I was saying, you have to have people's favor for them to support you. So you have to do all those quests that make people happy. We're going to skip all that because this character has already been already done all those side quests and stuff. So we're all good. So if we talk to this guy here, he should be able to support us. Uh, yes, you will support us. Lovely, jubbly. Uh, will you support us? My duty is to keep. No, that's true. Talk. All right. Let's get you to support us. Oh, you got a quest for me. All right. Will you support my campaign to become high king? Yes. <laughs> She's supporting me, even though her husband was the high king and was killed horrifically by being shouted to death. And uh, now I will become the high king. Now I was hoping there'd be some more people in here who'll give me support, but that's fine. We can just. We could just get those at a later date. There was a guy here who I did a quest for. I remember doing a quest for a guy here. Who, um, and he would be able to support us. But whatever. Let's just... Well, that'll be enough. We only need 20. It should be fine. Alright, so we're just going to head to the next major town now. And find the Yolls there. Uh, so, Morthal there. Boom. Already here we are at Morthal. It's snowing. This is a lovely town. Very, very pretty. Alright. Um, oh, what was that? Oh, there it is. A dragon. Alright, let's deal with this sod. I'll prove to the people why I should be High King. We shall do grand battle in this town. Alright. Guys, I'm about to prove to the people of this town why I should be High King. And they shall support me after I kill this damned beast. And absorb its power. Let's kill this dragon. It's only a blood dragon. They're pretty easy to kill. Die, you foul beast. There we are. It's dead already. Such an easy feat. Give me your power. And help me ascend to the throne of Skyrim. Ah, yes. Give me the power. Very nice. Oh, God. <laughs> Get stabbed in the face. All right, there we are. So, uh, let's go get the Yarl of Morthal, and I think I want to end the episode there. I want to keep this episode s short and sweet, because as of late, I've been checking my YouTube analytics, and uh, if they're telling me that you guys don't watch my longer, my longer kind of content that I upload, kind of the 20 plus a minute episodes. So, I'm keeping this short and sweet. It'll be much easier to consume that way. It will be easier to record and edit, and people will be watching for longer, which we want, so... Let's just get the support from these guys. Ah. Will you support my high king? Yep, 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 yep. Another supporter. We've got all and the will you support me to become my king? Yes. Great. We've got four supporters now. Four out of 20. So, yeah, I think we're going to leave it there, guys, actually. Let's it's see if this guy will support us. Yes, we've got another supporter. Grand. Grand, grand, grand. I feel a bit chilly. Oh, yeah, I've got Frostfall on, haven't I? There we are. Let's stand there. That looks awesome. Look at that. That's pretty awesome. What an awesome stance that is. So yeah, my friends, we're going to end it here. I want to keep these episodes short and sweet. My analytics tell me that short and sweet videos get watched to, to, to more, their, more to their entirety than my longer form content does. So I want to keep these episodes short so you guys will watch them to the end. So my friends, thank you for watching. Your viewership is always appreciated. I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye for now.